Hello guys, Austin here, and today, as you can see, we're going to do the tips and tricks on King Crab. So let's get started. Alright, so we're on the reasons.awiki, and this is the information on the boss, 20,000 to 50,000 HP, depending on the amount of people on the server. And the moves are Crab Jump, Crab Blast, and Crab Grab. And I'll be showing you these moves shortly. Alright, so we're about to go fight King Crab. Just gotta wait for the whole map to load and characters to load in as well. Alright, so this little beach house over here. What you want to do to get the max amount of tickets is to wait here. And then run. Hopefully there's not people in front of you. And then uh, in the house there's also tickets, but as you can see a wave comes. So if you're in the wrong place at the wrong time, uh, you'll get trampled that- Whoa! Like those three, you'll get- obliterated by that wave okay so here's King Crab I'm gonna go through his attacks right now he's doing the the smash attack with his claw and I'll just go through all of his attacks as he goes through it I'm not sure about the jump one though I I don't know if anyone's gonna jump on top of him maybe if he does then I guess I get to show it but as you can see those spikes are a smash attack and if you're in front of that, you will die. And if you're on the side, with max HP, if you're low, you will get obliterated by that as well. But if you're on the side, you have a possibility of surviving that. But it's it's pretty low. Oh, hey, look at that. I don't have any legs. Alright, so when someone gets grabbed like this, the only way that they can get free is if uh, the claw gets enough damage to it. And sadly, sometimes you can get double grabbed or even worse, triple grabbed. Hopefully this guy doesn't. Oh, it's just dragging him now. Oh, nope, he got triple grabbed. And that's a very sad fate for anyone, because you can't do anything about it. It's it's pretty sad. So the best way to avoid that attack is to, um... Is to have full stamina near him. So you have a shotgun, you can't really shoot from very far, you won't get the max amount of damage possible. Um, the best way to avoid that is if you have, uh... Stamina, you can just sprint away from him, and what I usually do is I'll jump on top of him, and he won't do the jump attack immediately, but if you jump over him, uh, he won't get grabbed, but if you stay on top of him for too long, he will do the jump attack, and you will die. So you don't want to be, be caught in that sad fate. And that's another reason to have good uh, lost stamina before you fight him. If uh, he's doing the smash attack, and you have no stamina... Uh, you can die very quickly and easily, so you don't want to be trapped in that fate. Alright, here we go. So, when the tickets spawn in, you want to go into places where no one else is going. Like, say, for instance, the water right now, or over by these umbrellas. Uh, probably don't want to go into the middle, because that's where everyone else is going to be going. So, yeah, just stay on the outside to where the tickets spawn. Or what my friend has done before is uh, run around the tickets, and he's gotten 20, 30 tickets per round, so it's very effective that way. Anywho, thank you for watching, and bye!